a new video. Today I have for you an unboxing video. I am back with one of these. Um, I feel like I've done quite a lot of these lately, but you guys really seem to be enjoying them. So I thought I would do another one given I made a sneaky purchase at Bulgari. So I basically sold a three of my handbags on Vestia Collective. If you don't follow me on Vestia Collective, I will link my account below. I also sell some of my stuff on Depop. And basically there were three bags that I was no longer loving as much as I did before. I sold my Prada bag and I saw a YSL tassel bag that I had in suede. The suede had faded a little bit on one of the corners. Um, and I also sold my um, speedy Louis Vuitton bag. And with that money and a little bit extra, I was able to buy a Bulgari piece. Um, and as you may have guessed, probably from everything I have said so far, it is a handbag. Um, and it comes in this beautiful Bulgari box. It is by far the most stunning box. Um, it almost feels like it's not card. It feels like it's sort of silk I would say almost. So the box has a stunning, stunning texture. It feels like material and it has like a sort of metallic-y, taupey colour. It is so, so beautiful with the Bulgari written down the centre. I would honestly keep this box to kind of store stuff in my cupboard because it is so, so beautiful and like I said it feels like fabric. It doesn't feel like card. So it opens up like this. It has a magnetic closure here. If I can open it... Okay, so I finally managed to open it, and inside is a little bit of paper. I'm going to put it on my lap to open it just because it's easier that way. So basically, this bag, let me tell you a bit about it. So like I said, I sold three bags, and I was looking for a black evening bag to replace the YSL that I had sold. And I had been fixated on Bulgari bags for a while. I thought they were very pretty, but I could never find kind of the right size or a model that sort of really blew me away. I liked the idea of having a Bulgari bag, but I had never found the exact Bulgari bag that I love. I love the ones that they have, um, sort of classic ones. I will look a picture somewhere on the screen now. But I didn't like the sort of um, rib they have around with the kind of sewn in stitches. I, I mean, I don't know, I'm not explaining myself very well, but I don't really like the uh, seams, sorry, that was the word I was looking for. The seams that show up, I don't really like how that looks. So I hadn't found my perfect one. But when I saw this, oh my god, it was love at first sight on their website. They actually had to order the bag from Amsterdam for me. It was the last one left in Europe because it was the last piece and I was so lucky that I finally got it. The ladies at Bulgari, I went to the Bulgari on Sloan Street. The staff were so, so helpful. Their customer service is honestly amazing. They were super helpful and they managed to secure this bag for me and order it in from Amsterdam. And I was absolutely thrilled to have it last week so without further ado I'm gonna go straight into it and open it up so I'm gonna take this tissue paper out and then in this beautiful dust bag which is like a very very soft sort of suede material um, in a very soft nudie color um, comes the bag oh my god I'm so excited and this is the beauty I purchased. It is one of the ones with the long strap and it is in the small size and it is actually a Skin Ray um, bag. Um, I am going to link the model down below. I can't remember what it's called. It's the Serpenti bag and it's in the Stingray material and it's in black and silver and it is honestly so beautiful. They have this one in gold and black as well and it is honestly stunning and I was very tempted to get that one which they did have in stock in the UK but because I already had my gold Gucci bag I didn't want another gold bag and this one is just honestly stunning. The hardware is in a sort of very soft champagne gold and it has the classic Serpenti which is almost like the scales of a snake. Um, design on the chain and then it has the beautiful stingray and then the lock has sort of a very an enamel finish in black and then in the middle it has the sort of glittery finish on the enamel but the glitter is sort of covered in a I don't know how to explain it, it seems like it's covered in glass almost um, so it won't come off um, and it has got a magnetic closure and then inside it's all leather and it looks something like this. It's quite spacious. I think it'll fit in all my essentials for a night out. Probably don't won't fit in too much for the day, but for a night out, pretty good. 
Um, and it also comes in with a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Bulgari mirror again in champagne gold with like a leather sort of tassel at the top to pick it up. And that sort of goes into the little small back pocket because the back only has a small back pocket here and then it's just a single pocket, it doesn't have any more dividers. Which is good because in a small bag if it has too many divisions you really can't fit anything. My only gripe with this bag is that the strap is very, very long. So if you're carrying it over the shoulder, which is how I would carry most evening bags, it does fall really low because I'm not that tall. But for crossbody it is fabulous. Um, and then you really can't shorten it because it's just a single chain so unless you sort of tie these two with like a rubber band or something I don't know how else you would be able to shorten it um, and yeah and then the back is super beautiful it has sort of the center the belly of the stingray here you can see it it looks almost like an eye um, and then it has this beautiful design with the silver and it's sort of very sparkly and perfect for evening but I really think you could use it during the daytime as well I guess depends how you style it up but it is honestly such a beautiful bag. I am so thrilled. I think it looks so stunning. And because it's Stingray, um, it is an exotic skin, but it's not as expensive as some of the other exotic skins. And I think it's something so original and so different because so many people have pied then and stuff, but Stingray is something that you don't see so often. And I actually love the fact that it's kind of sparkly, but this won't come off like glitter um, because it is actually the Stingray's um, actual kind of skin. So... It's just super beautiful. I am so thrilled. I think it is a perfect evening bag. Um, you could probably carry it as a clutch as well if you sort of put the strap in and I think it would look very pretty. Let me close that. Um, I think it would look very pretty as a clutch as well because it is quite small. I mean, compared to my hand, it's sort of the length of my hand and the width of a little bit more than my hand. So it is quite small, um, but it still fits in quite a lot to be honest because it's not um, too wide but it's not too slim either and also here on the closure it has Bulgari written all around this magnetic closure here and yeah and then around the sides it's just calfskin leather so it's just super beautiful I am so in love with it and I'm so thrilled to finally get my hands on it I've had to wait for over a month to get it because like I said they had to order it from Amsterdam um, and thank God they found this because it was the last, last piece. And if I would have missed out on this one, I wouldn't have got it. So um, they do have the gold one in Harrods, though, if you are interested in getting one. I think they just had two left. So do go quickly if you do want to get your hands on it. Um, I don't think they sell it online, but if I can find a link online, I will link it in the info box below. But yeah, so this is my latest acquisition. I think I'm going to get so much more out of it, especially now in the summer that you're wearing sort of more kind of going out at night and doing stuff over the holidays, so I'm super excited. I hope you enjoyed this video. That's all I had to ramble on about my new bag, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so, so, so much for watching, and I will see you in my next one. Bye.